I bet y'all been wondering which weapon is the best, which one's the worst. No, I haven't. Shut up, Bob. Nobody asked you. Anyways, I've compiled a rather interesting list and even managed to ask people what would be the best and what the worst weapons in Elite Dangerous. So, to kick off this series and contrary to the title, for everyone's enjoyment, I'll start with the most outrageous and disgusting birth defect riddled hell spawn and move from there. I've split all weapons in six different categories, where each weapon can swap places with others, depending on the context you give. Cause, let's be honest, just asking, ah, what would be the best weapon for me, would be pointless, a given scenario and context matters. Ah, but whatever, Yamux doesn't give two paraplegic operated roadkill catapults to care enough about context as is. So then quickly before we start the list, here are excluded weapons. These are really just tools, not weapons. Well, maybe mining lance is meant for combat. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm oh, sorry. Uh, I couldn't just finish that sentence with a straight face. <laughs> Combat weapon. What a good joke. Seriously though, three of these weapons are mining tools. Point defense is a utility that technically can deal damage and flak launcher, though used in combat, is only good against Targoid Swarm, while no other weapon can kill it, making it a tool, not a weapon. Alright, that's good, huh? Yeah, okay, well let's move on then to what I call the stillborn field of dumpster fire weapon tier. Every weapon in this tier is underbalanced, misdesigned, broken, and useless. And unless you think that shoving your head up the wood chipper is a good idea, or you just simply want to aggressively meme as if it's going out of style, do not use them. From this list, oddly, the weapon that I deemed to be the worst in one of my past videos is not worst anymore. Still, the video is well worth a watch, so check the description for the link. From this pile of twice used tampons and moldy cum rags, Torpedo turns out to be the least smelly and parasite riddled one. See, Torpedo would be the most usable from this list, but fuck me, is it still useless? But surprisingly, my thoughts have changed about it a little. Or rather, developers have screwed over other weapons so hard hard that the poor things need surgical anal intervention before they can walk again. Um, where was I? Oh! My opinion, just like my anus after a good spicy meal, quickly shifted after a fellow content creator by the name of Exegius notified me about the change. Or a bug. Gods, I hope it's a bug. For the mine launchers. See, now, mines take about 5 seconds to arm, and those that are not weapon savvy, arming time means that if this projectile hits anything in that time, it won't deal any damage. So think of it as a arming time for a bukkake bottle in a microwave. It will blow up at some point, but not right now. So basically, you can't even use mines as a defensive weapon anymore, which they exclusively are. First off, mines are useless against NPCs, there's no disputing that, making you question what was the point in the first place, but whatever. Now, due to this change, you will never hit your enemy unless for some reason your enemy felt sorry for you and rubbed lemon juice and bear mace in their eyes during a fight or a gank. The attacker literally has to be 5 seconds of time behind you, which let's be honest is near impossible for a ganker ship. Plus all the mines show up on the radar 8 fucking kilometers from you. What kind of a mine shows itself like that? What are developers doing with these stillborn fuel dumpster fire weapons? I have no idea. It feels like they're not playing their own game with them. And I'm the last person to suggest that line of thinking. Believe it or not, I've defended the developers and people used to say that, but now seeing so much shit, and not only in weapon segment of the game, I simply cannot deny it, and I hate that I have to say that. Yet, it's not over. Oh no, not yet. You know what would be even worse? If you had to do personal narrative, or simply grind a game for an unlock of a weapon that is complete shit. The Enzyme Missile, a dumpster fire missile that causes some small damage and adds the Space Aid's light 
version to the target for a limited time. By that I mean it applies additional damage over time. Not only deals basically a negligible amount of damage, it's also a non-homing, single size weapon that, as an extra insult, requires you to spend hours of quality elite gameplay, you know, grinding, before you are allowed to even use it. It's just disgusting, useless, and as said, insulting. So yeah, I'm thinking it's the worst weapon, despite my long rant on mines. As you see, mines still can be, I guess, deadly if you get lucky, but with enzyme missile, even point-blank perfect shots all the time will not kill a single ship. I still cannot believe that this one gimmick is what the designers of Elite Dangerous thought would be worth your grinding time, and moreover, see an actual use in combat. When I say this weapon is useless, I mean it is fucking useless. In fact, I think that you're better off with mining lands than this weapon. No, you know what? I don't think. It's a fact. That's how bad this piece of STD launching venereal disease spreading dumpster fire is. Congratulations, humans, you tried to replicate the Targoid Alien Lugi missile. Well, you made a cheap Chinese knockoff version that is comparable to the Elite Dangerous development as a whole. The initial execution was great, but every other new addition or update seems to pile up more crap on top and here we are, having our time totally not wasted. As the very last thing, I think this shouldn't be said, but I guess developers are so thick that it must be, every single weapon on this list has to be rebalanced immediately. So there you go, the stillborn fueled dumpster fire weapon tier. Do let me know what you think or whether or not you would add these specific weapons or take out some of them, which should raise a couple of more questions for you as a person, but regardless, leave a comment down below and of course share the video and all that stuff. Anyways, next up we have trash tier weapons. It's getting better, well, slightly, 